An upbeat Christopher Barnwell, who was among the tournament's top scorers, told NCN Sport that he recognized that he had a crucial role to play and stepped up when it mattered most, despite the loss to Trinidad. We didn't win the tournament, but I think the match against Jamaica was a wonderful feeling. You know the situation and know the innings that the team required, and I just went out there and I backed my ability and I played a match winning innings for the team. The young and promising fast bowler Ransford Beaton, who posed huge discomfort for a number of recognized batsmen with his pace and bounce, including big hitting Christopher Gale and Kyron Pollard, said he performed when it mattered most. I just go out in the game seeking advice on the senior players and try to hit my areas. No ball to how I know to uh, cost on the ball and it paid off. Many commentators, including the great Kurt Lee Ambrose and Ian Bishop, described Beaton as a future West Indies prospect. Meanwhile, veteran Shivnaran Chandapal, who was out of the semi-final and final because of injuries, expressed disappointment but said he is proud of the team. The last two games, it was the two biggest games of the tournament, the semi-finals and the finals, and couldn't play them. You, you know, you want to be there, you want to be out in the park, but... Um, you know, you don't want to go with an injury and handicap your team, you know, in the, in the, in probably in the beginning or the, or the middle of the game. So, um, you know, the best thing to do is just, you know, sit out and, and, and give someone else a chance to, to, to do the job. He credited Beaton and Barnwell, whose performances were well above par and is optimistic that a bright future lies ahead as the team now shifts gear for the regional four-day and won the encounters. Guyana won five of their eight encounters in the tournament. Alicia Grand Charles for NCN Sport.